Breaking news, guys. Members of Nigerian Headers Union, Mieti Hala, Storm Abuja Court, demand immediate release of their detained leader, Body Joe. They said Nigerian government must release their leader, Body Joe. They said they will not allow this to happen. Hmm? That they must release him. The members of Mieti Hala category and the correlation of ethnic nationalities for the defense of human rights on Wednesday. They staged a protest at the Federal High Court to demand the immediate release of their president, Bello Bodijo. The protesters displayed placards and described the continued detention of their leader as an affront to the rule of law and democratic uh, ten Tenant, ten, tenant, okay. The spokesman for the group, Comrade Kabiri Matazu, while addressing journalists uh, in front of the court, said, Body Joe had been held in communicado and not granted access to his family members by security agents. He said, until now, his family members have not been granted access to visit. Now we are coming out of the court and the case has been adjourned to March 22nd. We hope and pray that before then they will release him because he is not a criminal and he does not have a criminal record. There are bandits in the forest who they should have gone after, who are carrying arms but they only go after defenseless citizens. This is worrisome, and this shows they are not prepared. They did not, they, they, why did they not bring him to the court today? They have even failed to uh, establish a prime uh, phrase case against him. So they must release him immediately because we are uh, preaching, we are peace lovely people. We came here peaceful and we do not intend to cause havoc or violence, but we don't know what our uh, radical members might do. It is left for the government and the security agents to release Bello Bodijo unconditionally. <laughs> he said, he said something, he said uh, bandits are in the forest. The government should go after them. See and be praying that you should not find yourself in that in that position because there is nothing you can do about that. We get governments when not they here, they're not they here. Once they don't take you, they don't take you. Anything where you like, make you do. You get. Not be this the same country when we day when things they happen, this man go to support. Have you ever heard him say he condemned the killings and everything? going on in the country by Fulani Hesmen. Now you want to establish a vigilante group to protect who? When people are pointing finger at you people. So not be to finish people be that. Eh? You don't do things because you feel that Nigeria is banana republic, no man's land. You just do whatever you like. You know now, we have, the last time I checked, Nigeria have a constitution, even though we know that things are not the way it's supposed to be. But there is constitution in this country. You can't just go and start establishing, you know, a, a vigilante group. Who do you want to protect? And who ask you? There was never a time you, 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 you caution your people or you say, oh, like the, that killing in a plateau. The one that happened in the southwest that time, you know, that they, these people, they went to the church, slaughter people anyhow they like. What of the one that's been going on in the north, in the south-south? Most of these things, they know they, you will not know hear them for social media. Not all of them, then they bring out the come for social media. The truth is that these people, they are still very, very much on ground. Then they operate like Wella. Nothing is stopping them. <laughs> So now you won't come protect people when they talk so and people not good. So the thing gets us a bit. 
Well, this is not the, the time to the raise voice. So. Mm-hmm. I remembered when Namdekano, the IPOB leader now in Southeast, when he was brought back to Nigeria. And uh, during Muhammad Buhari's time, the Northern Edas, they went to meet President Bola Metinubu. This man hit his hand on the, on, on the, on, on, on the, on the ground that Namdekano can never be released because he's a terrorist. He killed his people in the southeast and everything. And for that, he dares present Muhammad Buhari to release Mazen Namdekano and get them face. So you see, this life is like that. We have to be very careful because you don't know what will be for you tomorrow. Today, he's now in the same um, position now with Namdekano, begging the Nigerian government to release him. Oh, I've not done anything. I'm not a criminal, this and that. Well, thank God, the, the case is already in the court. When it, as they are going to the court, we tell the government that it's not a criminal. Uh-huh. So you will be the one to tell the court that you are not a criminal. So it's not left for them whether to release you or you, you stay there for life. So that is it. So guys, what's your take on this? I'm dropping it here. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Thank you.